Well, when I saw this on Amazon, I just had to try it. What we have here is we have an extension handle for Jiffy Bot so that you can run it over a fire. And the way that you do it is I'll have to just uh, take the uh, advertising stuff off of here. Take the little ties off. And Jiffy Pop is actually a little bit hard to find these days, but you can still find it. They still make it. It's made by ConAgra, which is one of the largest food companies in the U.S. And the way this works is you simply have a little notch here that goes under the end of the Jiffy Pop. And then you bring this end up and that locks it in place. So essentially what we have here is a long handle for our Jiffy Pop. And this is made by Wilcore Outdoors, item CMP1669, made in China. So we're going to take it over to the fire and try it. Okay, I think the fire's burnt down enough so we have some nice coals near the edge. So I'm just going to put it here and uh, see what happens. Just do a little shaky shaky. I don't have the technique down maybe straight and I don't know if it's easier to go forward and back or side to side. It seems like it's a little easier to do side to side. Most people that I've seen that do jiffy pop over the stove constantly, constantly agitate it. So we're just going to keep going like this. And this uh, handle is a good four foot long, so I'm not really getting any heat from uh, the fire. Here we go, we're starting. I think we're about done. Okay, now let's look at the verdict. Yeah, we've got a few on pop kernels, but I just didn't want to burn it. Not too bad though, not a lot of them. There we go. Oh, that was good. Excuse me for eating in front of you, but sorry. 